everyone, myself M. Rajkumar, Assistant Professor, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Rogani College of Engineering and Technology. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss about thermodynamic cycles. Thermodynamics that means the air standard cycles. Air standard is nothing but thermodynamics power cycle that convert heat energy into mechanical power by considering air as a working fluid with constant specific heat that is Cp and Cv. In this cycle, the air is the only working fluid that goes through changes in its thermodynamic properties to convert heat into mechanical power. In this cycle, there is no internal energy generation by means of burning any fuel inside of engine. The heat is extremely added by means of heat exchanger and also it is rejected by using heat exchanger to the sink. It consists of non-flow process. It means that the certain amount of air is continuously performed successive cycles. No intake or exhaust of air is permitted into the cycle. Hence it works as a closed cycle with no mass transfer. Working fluid air is considered an ideal gas with constant specific heat. Okay, the air standard cycle is an idealized cycle. It is found on the following approximations. The so working fluid throughout the cycle is only air. The air acts as an ideal gas. Combustion process are replaced by well defined heat addition process and the exhaust process is replaced by a heat rejection that is the efficiency of the thermal efficiency equal to net work done into total input that is a total heat input then uh, different that is a air standard cycles so different types of air uh, cycle is there one is the Carnot cycle then auto cycle or petrol cycle then diesel cycle then the air sandal dual cycle and breakdown cycles in which we are going to uh, explain the auto cycle the auto cycle pv diagram and uh, ts diagram in pv diagram so in which the one two two process is uh, the isentropic compression process that is uh, uh, one two two is the isentropic compression in which the pressure is increases from P2 to P1 sorry P1 to P2 and temperature increases from T1 to T2 same times volume also reduce you can see this uh, PV chart pressure increase P1 to P2 and uh, uh, volume reduce from P1 to P2 then entropy remains constant you can see this uh, TS diagram, 1, 2, 2 process, entropy S1 equal to S2. Same time, the process 2, 2, 3 is a constant volume heat addition process. Here, you can see this uh, line, vertical line, 2, 2, 3. So, in this, uh, pressure P2 to P3 increases, volume remains constant, that is V2 equal to V3. In this section, we are giving the input are giving the input of heat supply that is qs equal to mcv into t3 minus t2 here t3 is the final temperature t2 is a initial temperature then process 3 to 4 is a isentropic expansion process 3 to 4 is a isentropic process here also the pressure in pressure decreases from p3 to p4 same times uh, volume increases from P3 to P4 uh, that time 3 to 4 you can see this T, uh, TS diagram uh, entropy remains constant S3 equal to S4 then 4 to 1 is a constant volume heat rejection process here also volume also constant so volume reduced from V4 to that is uh, volume pressure reduced from P4 to P1 that time the heat rejection that is qr equal to m cv into t4 minus t1 so m is the mass cv to specific volume at constant volume 
and temperature final temperature minus initial temperature so we know the work done of the cycle w equal to heat supply in minus heat rejection heat supply means m into cv already we uh, find out the heat supply mcv into t3 minus t2 minus heat, heat rejection equal to mc b into t4 minus t1 the efficiency equal to formula efficiency for auto cycle equal to work done developed that is the output by input this is a common formula so output means we getting work is the output and we are giving the heat supply is the input Apo work work done w equal to qs minus qr divided by qs qs we know mcv into t3 minus t2 and qr you know mcv into t4 minus t1 so divided by mcv into t3 minus t2 so in this equation the common mcv value mcv is common so we can strike out the mcv value we get final 1 minus t4 minus t1 divided by t3 minus t2 from pv diagram total cylinder volume v1 equal to v4 clearance volume vc equal to v2 equal to v3 so stoke volume vs equal to v1 by v2 equal to v4 by v3 you can see this uh, pv diagram clearance volume equal to v2 then uh, compression ratio r equal to v1 by v2 otherwise we can say v4 by v3 then process we, uh, we know the thermodynamics uh, relation pvt relation from that uh, relation uh, t2 by t1 equal to t1 into r the whole ratio to gamma minus 1 similarly process 3 to 4 T3 equal to T4 into R the whole power comma minus 1. Substitute this T2 and T3 value in auto cycle. We, we get in this equation that is 1 minus T4 by T1 divided by T4 into ga, R the whole power gamma minus T1 into R the whole power comma. From this uh, equation we strike out the uh, common uh, T4 minus T1. So finally we got the efficiency formula 1 minus 1 divided by R the whole power gamma minus 1. This is the efficiency for auto cycle. Thank you.